tribe how's everyone how's your thursday so i want to do a pick a card what is happening with your twin flame soulmate future spouse energy update what is going on with your love life so i am on the road and it's going to be halloween in the end of the month it's going to be 10 days or like you know two weeks from now so i want to use my special halloween deck and let's see we're going to jump into that festive vibe of spooky halloween so anyway if you want to um request your update your future spouse, twin flame, soulmate, love and career or spiritual journey or any other questions, three questions, five questions, you can email me spiritualexplorer1111 at gmail.com. So, happy early Halloween <laughs> meow, meow, meow. to all of you, my soul tribe. So, I use some paper towel here so you can see your choices. Pile one. To those who think they want to pick pile three, music, and hand, pick your choices. The sacred tree, the enchanting music, and the spiritual hand pick your choices and i manage to pick me and magic picks and collected some flowers and pine tree and pine cones at central park this morning so i can put and use on our table so thank you my soul tribe i hope you are going to make your choices i'll give you a moment and let's go Calling on my spirit guides, my guardian angel, the assistance of the higher power and the spirit of the universe as we're going to channel messages, possible energies, advice for my collective spirit guides, for our twin flame, soulmate, future spouse journey. This is their energy update, their latest energy update or whatever. They gravitate, gravitate into this channeled message in their most specific time in their life. Guidance, please. Thank you very much. As you all know, Soul Tribe, we are at Park Avenue, Manhattan, New York City. I'm on the road. So, flowers for every one of you, Soul Tribe. Happy, happy, happy autumn. The colors of autumn and the flowers of autumn. Let's go. Whoever picked pile three. I think I'll just leave the paper towel here. I did not bring any, um, I did not bring any mantle or something because I was trying to pack light. So, so child, I hope you have a good day. And look, there's pine cones in here too. So, we are loaded, so tribe, and we are approaching the holidays. But first, stop the Halloween. So, I'm using our special Halloween tarot. Okay, so let's go. Just for, we're having fun at the same time, we're asking the truth. Okay, for those who take pile sacred tree, what is going on with your twin flame soulmate future spouse journey? Five of bats. Hmm. Five of bats is like the five of wands, competition, rivalry, obstacles. But there's some masculine energy here, okay? It feels like feeling pressured in the society, feeling pressured in his life right now. So someone is blocking him to come towards you or someone is trying to like, like, you know, um, manipulate and control him right now on what he wants to do so there's a masculine right now he's kind of feeling stuck i'm just trying to say he or a masculine because this is like a male energy or a masculine energy like that i am seeing right now but there's a full moon up above him so that also means that he knows he knows what time is it okay he knows that 
some things are not good for him he knows he's being controlled manipulated he knows something is not right right now so he is aware okay there is a masculine he is aware so let's let's see okay you might be connecting with someone who's who's going through like some things in their life was feeling stuck but they are aware or you might be feeling the blockages and the pain in in your life right now spirit guys i'm just going to pick in the table i'm not going to be picking under the table in the table please what is happening um thank you very much page of pumpkin yeah here here you go divine feminine here you go here you go female energy so spirit guys says page of pumpkins is the page of pentacles you might be thinking are you going to meet this wonderful person are you going to meet your twin flame soulmate future spouse is there a way or opportunity or chance for you to be together well all i can tell you right now if you are a female energy or a divine feminine spirit guide says there is chance there is opportunity for new love or for an offer of love offer of feelings to um to come in your life okay so you're going to get a proposal um someone's going to ask you out on a date or you're going to meet someone okay even if you might be feeling like someone is blocking your true love okay to come your way well i'm seeing someone with light hair like a fair man and i am seeing someone like a female energy who is dark haired straight hair okay so anyway petite um she's intuitive okay i i can see that and she um she wants to believe in her dreams or you need to be hopeful so this could mean that this female energy is seeing her twin flame her soulmate her future spouse in her dreams okay because like sh she could she could feel him or they could you could feel each other okay that's how i could understand but there your your connection right now doesn't come without challenges because right now you are having trouble with your physical meeting your fated meeting um if this person still needs to come your way something is blocking him or if you are together well this person is still like you know having to tell you how they feel about you so let's 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 see okay let's let's see but but the more the more i'm trying to get into your energy i think universe is trying to tell you they will give you the chance okay never lose uh, that hope uh, that love will still come your way or true love okay the chance of true love to come your way so three of ends yes because you've been in this journey the long waiting period the like you know never ending confusion never ending questions okay of who is the one for you because this three of ends you know what I might be mistaken myself, I'm sorry because I don't use, I only use this once in a blue moon. But the five of bats is the five of swords. Regardless, five of swords is almost the same as the block, okay? The obstacle, something blocking them like competition, rivalry, okay? It's, the, it's still the same or same, I'm sorry, because I think the three of imps is the three of wands, okay? Someone waiting, okay? So it could be a female energy waiting for her partner to um tell her how he feels about her she's waiting for this person okay to um to come find her to be with her to offer her the commitment that she wants like she's praying to god and the universe for the chance to meet this special someone to to be happy to have her happily ever after to have a chance to feel true love to be like not be feeling like she's just alone and helpless and and lonely okay so she's waiting for her lover and her future spouse future husband to come 
her life okay i'm saying her because i'm picking up a feminine been waiting and manifesting and dreaming and praying for her one true love the tower i kind of knew it to end this separation because i kind of knew that there's competition rivalry there could be a painful separation between you two or sometimes you cannot meet eye to eye if you're together so it's spirit guide says it's it's the lesson of this journey okay whether you're in twin flame soulmate future spouse it's like it's a lesson for you how to be good towards each other how to make the effort towards each other it's kind of like your journey each of you okay your journey towards your transformation towards your transition towards the darkness and the light okay it feels like you know you might be thinking like you are uh different from each other but universe trying to tell you you need to like gather all your strength so you can be stable for each other how are you going to build a bridge how are you going to tell each other you love each other very much if one little thing of tests and challenges and then you break down okay you break on and off on and off and not on and off so so universe says you need to be stable for each other your love for each other should be should be strong okay even if right now even if right now the separation could be really really challenging you know this tower moment could also be like the obstacles or maybe you know there could be a feminine right now she's going through health problem or she went through a very painful dark night of the soul or if someone okay like a divine masculine like you know got distracted and and uh choose the the other way okay because they thought they he thought like the pasture is greener on the other side but the universe says for you feminine or for you pile one it's not the end yet in your love story okay it's not the end yet in the love in your love story because spirit guy says you need to believe in yourself you need to believe in your dreams you need to manifest okay just because your prayers and your dreams did not happen overnight doesn't mean that you're that it's not going to happen because it feels like there's you pile one you are feeling hopeless right now because you've been manifesting praying and then you're feeling like yeah god and universe just um did not listen to to your prayer so what now ace of pumpkins okay so you're praying for someone to end the separation you're praying for this someone to offer you that commitment that marriage that proposal okay to really solidify like you know if it was just an um a beginning of feelings or something like that you want these feelings or you want this person to stay in your life to be your one true and only like to be serious with you so you know what can i see what can i understand with ace of pentacles to be to be with a person who is a good provider, generous, trustworthy, reliable, okay? So, you know, Ace of Pentacles is also a, um, an energy of abundance, wealth, and luxury. So, when we are talking about wealth and luxury, maybe this you are go going to marry and connect with a person, okay? A future spouse or a potential suitor or a potential new love okay a potential next relationship that they are a person of means and wealth and have a lot of connections okay and uh, possibly business-minded entrepreneur but more so okay this could be a message of wealth or an energy carrying wealth or or a person coming your way who's going to have a lot of love and a lot of feelings for you who is ready to offer you commitment so so these endings that come your way it's not going to be forever these obstacles that that you are encountering right now because it has to happen all these endings all these life lessons 
this separation is not a curse actually you have to look at it as a blessing in disguise because while you're in separation or while you are going through in this journey okay um uh, sometimes you might be feeling like like you don't understand this but the universe says they're working on themselves your future spouse your twin flame your soulmate and so are you until such time you are both ready to really be committed towards each other and offer yourselves towards each other and say you are in here for tips okay through good times and bad times so anyway i think the universe is just trying to teach you both to be strong for each other but let's let's guess seven of ghosts okay seven of ghosts is seven of cups so if there is a masculine here needing to um, walk away from temptations vices addictions or karmic connections needing to walk away from their old belief systems needing to uh, let go of pride and ego so but there's also a message from a masculine they're very sorry okay they're going to work hard on themselves so they can give you that stability they can be ready for you emotionally physically mentally they can give you that proposal they you know so you won't be feeling like you're just the only one trying or you're feeling very much like left out because sometimes you feel like you weren't prioritized so i think like there is a message here from someone like uh, they were saying to you pile one that i'm so sorry i haven't prioritized you i'm so sorry i haven't seen you before but now i'm working on myself to give you that love and that stability yeah look it is a divine masculine awakening i tell you working on their balance working on their spiritual awakening there's also a divine masculine here went through a very painful spiritual transformation okay also went through uh, like some dark night of the soul which i already trying to tell you that both of you are like you know need continue to do on your inner work um healing your inner child healing the trauma in your life um and um continue on your shadow work okay like expelling out all the darkness all the fear that's coming in the surface sometimes it has to come into the surface so you can heal it and you can close the past okay so anyway be willing to forgive and forget and be more compassionate with each other and not uh, be like so judgmental so you both have some work to do heart to heart conversation communication okay how to like fight the battles together and not away from each other okay and not trigger each other so there's also a message here for you pile one if there's any triggers and chaos and misunderstanding you need to find a way out of this because right now this is what you need to work on your balance okay the balance of divine masculine divine feminine in inside of you or from both of you okay so until then your your um your love life right now is feeling very shaky your twin flame journey is kind of like You've been waiting for here forever okay and then um in your soulmate connection as well you'll be feeling like yeah is your dreams going to be answered so anyway so far that's how i could see okay eight of go see walk away from things people places that no longer serves you this is walking away from the past continue on your shadow work continue on your sacred journey continue on your spiritual transformation and spiritual evolution that's the only way to go to close the past to release the past or um if you were connecting with someone with a third party karmic connection vices addiction they need to say no to their to this um vices addictions karmic connections and someone or if someone needing to release karmics or exes okay so this is how i could see right now so you can you can start your brand new beginning okay that's that's how you know, see and never fear the unknown because i feel like both of you 
are scared okay so universe is trying to say you need to trust and surrender and have faith on each other okay because the universe and god up above is is going to guide both of you so you can find each other so you can find your destiny okay never fear the unknown tree of pumpkins because you have guardians you have help you will build yourself back up again just because you were you hit rock bottom and you feel like you were feeling lost and you're feeling unhealthy and you are feeling so sad and lonely right now doesn't mean you will not have help and support because spirit guides and universe trying to tell you right now they're going to help and support you when it comes to your love life your your um, twin flame connection there's going to be end of obstacles and of sadness and of darkness there will be passage and support and help for you so as of this time you know you might not understand your life purpose your life mission but ask help from others as as help from god pray okay and be stable and sane in all ways so you know there's also a masculine energy here is this a masculine yeah I'm trying to tell you too that they're going to ask help from others you know good advices maybe they're going to start praying to god and trusting their intuition because they they will no longer be listening to toxic people friends and family that's trying to um like tell them something because of selfish reasons so they you know there is a masculine here they're awakening to the truth now okay and what is that truth that you know they need to trust themselves and they that this person needs to evolve that's it okay so he can so they can find their way to you so that you can meet each other halfway or you can meet each other heart to heart soul to soul okay because right now you still have some things to do in your connection so that's how i can understand and we can go on and on and on but alas we still have pile two and pile three to really analyze and interpret your eyes mesmerize me whatever the drama you've been going through you still have you know your partner is trying to tell you something about you something about your eyes your mesmer you mesmerize me you're captivating me like i adore you something like that so maybe the first time you're going to meet each other there's going to be spiritual downloads you know when two soulmates two twin flame meet or future spouse meet it's kind of like you're going to have downloads that yeah it feels like you've known this person forever so you're going to have that feeling okay you make me believe in love and something about you make you make them feel alive you make them feel like love is very much possible so someone is going to come your way to make you believe in love again or you're going your your purpose and your mission in life right now is to heal someone and make this person believe in love again because that's how i could see okay and bring hope to this person's life or you are going to meet someone who's going to bring hope into your life and make your wishes and dreams come true and if your hope is your commitment wedding happily ever after and be your best friend someone is going to listen to you and understand you and tell you you're beautiful amidst all your quirks your imperfections basically this is a person who's not going to be judgmental okay this is like a person who's generous understanding and ready to commit to you it's just a matter of time for you pile one but right now you know all this veil of mist and fog and fork in the road okay it's going to lift up eventually but you have to keep going okay because right now you might be feeling like there's a veil between you and your future spouse your twin flame your soulmate but i am seeing the glimmer of light in the distance okay and may you find each other or may you meet each other halfway okay so you can like you know have your 
true union hope i tell you see this is not a coincidence here back to back to back to back not all hope is lost in your love life not all hope is lost in your twin flame love connection not all hope is lost if you are someone who's feeling lost afraid alone and lonely and you have to ask guardians for help i tell you you have support you have guides okay heaven could also mean divine intervention this could be spirit guides and guardian angel the holy spirit jesus christ sorry so tribe you know like there's too many too many religion but i only know that we only have one god so right now in all the darkness that you went through universe says you need to ask angels for help like the divine intervention and how are you going to ask divine intervention through prayer through having faith okay so that's how i could see so i mean pile one i could only try to understand like seriously we are on the 25 minute mark because kitty cat can only 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 try so try and let's see pile music what are you dealing right now how what is going on with your love life we are using the halloween tarot because we're jumping on the halloween spirit the halloween festive mood <laughs> with the cool breeze of autumn what is happening ace of pumpkins okay so what is going on with your love life you are praying for someone to come your way to be a good provider to be your emperor or to be your empress like you want to be with someone who is stable for you ready to commit to you like you don't want to be playing anymore so you're going to meet someone who's going to um be generous be kind be honest to you okay someone who's going to be your business partner or your life partner okay so let's see someone who's going to um, help you with your finances mentally emotional physically in all aspects okay so um spirit guys what is happening for pile two the empress i tell you someone someone is coming your way empress your emperor is trying to tell you i am here i'm always been here for you maybe your journey to step into your power as the empress is not the most easiest you have to go through the darkest and the darkest but you already come out of it you are strong and nothing is going to separate us because i tell you my love for you is always true i love you very much and you have to know that and and um maybe you are already married on the spiritual realm okay other lives past lives dimension lives universe already trying to say you have a very strong bond for each other you have a very strong spiritual connection so anyway if you know there is a divine feminine she is very much evolved okay there is a feminine here she is very much intuitive full of wisdom okay went through some trauma and hardship in life but um she wants she's wishing and praying for home family children her happily ever after like her own um happiness okay so she's seeking stability she's seeking for the house the home the family okay so i already said that okay so anyway anyway let's see i tell you empress emperor you are like waiting for your union together so what now seven of what's but there's always drama we get it seven of swords so right now something is blocking you what is the reason what are the reasons that's blocking you right now something like the, the divine masculine still need to learn lessons from okay like an unfinished business so whatever it is this person needs to finish it okay but this person is already trying to promise you and give you the reassurance that they are here for you i will be here for you i will be there something like that but i need to finish some 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 lessons some soul contract in my life if um, i have hurt you in the past 
if I felt like I have betrayed you and um, I have broken your heart because like you were expecting that, you know, you did not expect that this is going to be a hard journey, pile two, but universe trying to say, your partner is trying to tell you he's, he's going to work on this unfinished business, okay? If it's unfinished life lessons, he's going to clear up the mess, okay? He's going to mend what is broken. He's going to make things right with you. So this is kind of strong right now. Tree of pumpkins. Because he is going through self-therapy, self-help. Or is asking support from guardian angels and universe and and spirit guides this could be the spiritual and the religious community so um okay so there is a masculine right now or your partner pile too he's working on his faith he's building his his faith back to god okay um, he's trying to believe in the law of the universe because it feels like before he thinks he can take all the matters in his hands okay he was he was thinking like he can you know all of us has the power to change our destiny anyway but before he was kind of like you know have like have doubts with universe and God, but now um he's he's trying to build more trust and faith to the higher power okay to help him get out of this mess because i feel like there's also a masculine here going through um like some health problem or personal struggles in their life so i also feel pile too that they're not happy where they are right now so what now um but this is the journey of the empress and the emperor anyway nothing is going to be handed to you but you're both warriors anyway so what eight of pumpkins i tell you look there is a masculine energy here working hard he's a workaholic or he's numbing all the pain through work okay he's a builder um he, or you know he's very creative so right now um that's how i i could um understand okay if you are going to ask me where is your future spouse where is your twin flame he's building on a new project or um he's working on something or he's truly like a night all nighter right now he's he's working he's focused on work okay or he's trying to tell you He's working on himself, but I, the more I, but you know, the more I understand here, I think it's much more of like, it's a masculine, okay? Like truly working hard on something, okay? Like, I feel like they need to let go of this pressure of like being hard on themselves but it feels like this person really wanting to be successful and stable in life so um yeah i i get the story here now your energy update you know you might be someone pile two who feeling like you don't know where you stand with this person because you might be connecting with someone who's still choosing money okay or needing to work on their career or their um, finances. So let's see, let's see, okay. Um, eight of M's, eight of ones. Eight of ones is also adventure, passionate connection. You're very much attracted towards each other. Eight of ones could also mean freeing yourselves from the obstacles. So what is this? Okay, so universe says, this person you are connecting possibly keeping their feelings buried within themselves so now they have to free themselves from like both this all these bottled emotions and you know tell you how they feel about you okay or like simply be they need to put themselves out there for like you know to 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 have a new fresh beginning something like that because to have the opportunity so you can write your love story now okay something like that but anyway 
I think the problem here is the masculine wasn't ready before because they wanting to be successful in life. They they really like searching searching for success. And then there's a feminine here. She's quite frustrated, but she's evolved anyway. And she's here like saying, where are you? My future spouse, my emperor, my twin flame. Don't you see me that I am here? But subconsciously, their higher selves of your partner, your twin flame or your divine masculine is trying to say, I am here. Nothing is what it seems. Nothing is what it seems, what you see on the physical world. I am here working on myself. I am here wanting to be free from all these obstacles so i can be with you okay so we can like like embrace this adventure and this new beginnings together okay so anyway i feel like this is what i could understand for you ten of bats but like i said there's a masculine here he could have be suffering from mental health emotional health emotional struggles or could also be physical health because 10 of us is 10 of source but regardless you both need rest okay they need to recharge they need to rest and they will recover because 10 of bats that means whatever pain you went through you can get through this okay you can pass through it this storm is not going to stay forever okay so you need healing you need to uh renew your energies and keep your vibration high okay and the nine of imps okay so there is a there's a message from your partner that you need to be patient with this person okay because this is what the personal struggles that i already trying to tell you right now they are suffering from like you know they could be feeling tired and exhausted okay how to build back their their enthusiasm in life how to um see the colors again because i feel like there's a masculine they were seeing black and white and gray so what you need to do pile two as the empress you need to bring colors back into your love life you need to bring the colors and the rainbows and the sun back into your connection okay you need to light each other's way i'm not going to get um under the table still guys i just need to understand in the table please so what now seven of imps and seven of wands yeah look it's another masculine energy again trying to ask for help it's a cry for help from you if you are having a painful separation and no communication with this person or you still have to meet this person just know that if this is a twin flame connection or future spouse or soulmate they are trying to ask for your help they are trying to ask for your patience for your understanding and they are also trying to ask god up above to help them to help them free themselves from all these these struggles that they're going through right now because there's a masculine at one point in their life they're feeling they're feeling afraid okay they are afraid to release their fears okay because in the earthly realm they want to be successful so it feels like they were resisting they were resisting to embrace the, their transformation ace of ghosts but love conquers all okay so spirit guy says yeah sometimes it's so hard to release pride and ego and all the earthly materialistic whatever but i think there's some masculine here realizing that money cannot buy love and happiness at the end of it all love conquers all love is going to conquer this separation all this darkness chaos that you are experiencing right now so at the end of it all ace of cups also means like unconditional love selfless love okay or like you know if your journey is full of pain then you know it's time for you to purify and uh, pour all this dirty water because and then time for you to like you know think about 
how to start again so you know what i can understand here for you pile two is like a chance for new love or a chance to for reunion okay to start all over again a second chance at love that means reunion or a chance to bring that one true love into your life but there's a lot of drama here that you're going through but all i can tell you right now someone is trying to say be patient with me because i am here nothing is what it seems even if you're like thinking there like yeah where am i i am here i will come your way i will i will try everything in my power to like not my that break my promise to you because i love you very much so so try that's how i could understand there's no sense like squeezing you know but someone's trying to tell you i love you okay someone's trying to tell you they love you very much and they are here so you take my bread away and you take their bread away there's no one else like you you're the most wonderful thing that ever happened in their life maybe it took them some time to understand that to see that truth but that's how you have my heart and you've always have their heart okay that's why i was already picking up that they're trying to tell you like i am here i will be here or they're trying to say my heart belongs to you we are we belong to each other so something like that that you are a part of each other so what now you make me better see and you make me better oh my god how do i even explain this and channel this because we already been channeling um your partner pile two who needs to be better for you because you know right now they could be numbing themselves from work or maybe they were resisting the change but it's a promise okay that they're going to be better for you and um they're giving you the assurance anyway that you are their heart that you have their heart and you take you take their breath away so anyway the attraction is still there okay so whatever this person needs to finish in the soul contract okay support them but give them your love and your light and you know your prayer and ask all universe and god up above and angels to like guide them and then so you can be together very 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 soon because i could also feeling like very soon in your energy okay so anyway soon my love godspeed my love that's it hope not all hope is lost okay so anyway um hope also means the dream to be together the dream for your union oh my god back to back to back you know this hope in heaven, I also saw this in pile one, but you know, heaven also means divine intervention, but you know, we cannot ignore this because sometimes messages could be repeated. But anyway, let me see more. Shh. Dragon means strong, okay? You have to stay strong for each other. Dragon also means be brave and have courage. Like step into your power, Empress, anyway. But your Emperor is already trying to tell you they're going to be strong. And they'll be here for you and help. I already knew that. Someone needing to take care of their help. So if there's a masculine energy not feeling well, they're trying to tell you they're going to build their 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 health back up again, their enthusiasm, their energy to believe in this journey. Or if you are someone who's not feeling well, pile two, spirit guide says, bring back, bring back your energy to heal yourself as well and believe, okay, that you can heal. Or like bring back your self-worth because remember, and how are you going to build back your self-worth? do things that make you happy do things that make you feel good okay like um you know that's how they say self-love um and learning to love yourself because how are you going to heal and attract the love that you want and the blessing that you want if you feeling empty and you you don't 
love yourself so i mean it kind of like makes sense anyway but i was picking this health anyway so that's that's it okay maybe both of you pile too you're not feeling well health wise right now mentally emotionally physically in a way you're kind of mirroring each other's energy right now but i am feeling empress and emperor energy so you're already like a, a warrior of your own and he's fighting for you you're going to fight for him but it's much more of a female energy needing to be strong and brave okay into this journey because nothing is what it seems in the physical world your future spouse even if you're having a hard time right now they're here okay so we are just seeing a glimmer of light right now so try but we can try okay so spiritual hand you know so try for all, all my so try my collective i just like i'm just being transparent i picked pile three <laughs> spiritual hand okay raspberry pomegranate raspberry tea so last but not the least let's see magic come on magic come on magic you want to say hi to soul tribe come on come on come on she's stuck in the blanket okay spiritual hand pile three what is happening with your love life let's go the world the world means closure endings from the past that you're not going to be the same as you were yesterday. So the world could also mean travel, relocation, okay? Or keep your vibration high. Or you are seeking and praying and dreaming for new beginnings and fresh start. Or if you are someone who's waiting for this twin flame, this future spouse, this soulmate to come your way, it could be a new love, okay? It could be like a like a fresh energy, okay? Like like a rush of energy trying to tell you from someone who loves you very much that we got this okay we're going to work on this so anyway that's how i could see right now and interpret the world the world is good because it's new cycle okay it's like it's kind of like close the old chapter and then write a new chapter and make make that chapter a page turner <laughs> make that chapter beautiful and full of hope and optimism and like something like wonderful okay wonderful affirmations so let's see justice justice means what is happening here is someone going through legal problems or someone needs to be objective and know that these problems will have a solution okay so justice also means like you know their justice means like the karma the the good karma the bad karma so anyway i feel like pile three spirit guys wants you to not forget your life purpose your life mission you could be an empath earth angel star seeds indigo light worker you could be asking how are you going to accelerate this union how are you going to accelerate these manifestations of your dreams to become a reality for your happily ever after then universe says you have to like do good deeds that's how i could understand to distinguish good karma from bad karma okay and never deviate from the path you are on the right path okay because you know you might be thinking like sometimes you have trouble letting go you're not ready to let go of things that you things people places that you no longer need in your life maybe you are trying to like 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 scared to take off the blindfold but truth will set you free okay because right now you kind of need renewal because the world also means renewal okay like you need to bring back 
the passion in your in your life or you need to follow your passion or it's time to go after your dreams and fight for it fight for your happiness fight for your true love that, i mean that's how i could understand right now no one is going to tell you that you are not capable of like you know you're not capable of taking action so you can manifest your dreams you know no one is allowed to tell you that you cannot dream no one is allowed to tell you that you cannot fall in love okay so the universe wants you to like um cut ties with this karmic karmic dabs okay with this like something like a karmic energy that is holding you back like you're feeling like like you know um cut ties with all this poverty and and um i don't know how to explain this is very guides you know you might have like feeling block right now to manifest the your heart's desire but universe says you do not let your fear and all these blocks control you okay so you have to fight with all your might okay to um to have your wonderful new beginning to come your way okay so that's how i could i could understand all right so maybe you are someone who just want like you know you don't want to get stuck anymore you want to free yourself you want to manifest love to come your way whether it's this new love or you're giving it to the universe like whatever will be will be we are going to find out three of us i kind of knew it turn pain into power you have to let go of yourself and never let the past lure you back in okay three of bats is three of swords all this pain that you went through all this trauma or someone has hurt you you have to forgive yourself for being angry you have to forgive others as well who has hurt you that's the only way for you to have your new beginnings and fresh start okay that's why i already know the endings the closure in, in order for you to heal from the pain in order for you to um like you know end the separation between you if you encounter the twin flame and then you're in separation spirit guy says forgiveness okay forgive each other and be willing to grow and like you know it feels like if it's a plant you have to water and take care like really give tender loving care okay in your relationship so it can grow and flourish okay so anyway that's how i could understand why is this spirit guys four of wind four of imps is four of wands so maybe some things did not happen in the past the way you wanted it to because it wasn't ready before and it wasn't meant to be but universe is trying to give you the message that there is marriage in your horizon there is marriage waiting for you in your future there's a lot of excitement that you need to um be hopeful and be excited about because four of wands is someone coming your way to offer you happiness stability the strong feelings okay so anyway maybe spirit guy says all these obstacles all this misunderstanding and chaos um you have to go through it anyway because no relationship is perfect but regardless you're going to have you're happily ever after once you are ready once you are both ready but i know you're ready anyway you're so ready since few years ago pile three but universe says you know the endings of the old cycle because you are on your way towards your new cycle okay because you're not going to take no for an answer you are going to tell yourself that you deserve love and you, you deserve to be happy and that's it okay all is fair in love and war five of bats and no one is going to tell you no because look there's a masculine here um you know he's also walking his soul contract he was 
feeling manipulated and controlled okay by his fears or toxic people places and the pressure of the society or community around him because he doesn't want to do that anymore but the thing is he was still feeling stuck there so you need to really um pray that your partner is also going to like fight his own battles as you are also fighting your own battle right now because pile three you are fighting all this sadness this anger and this heartache right now okay like all the storm that you went through in your life all the losses so your partner is also going through their um their own pressure right now so how are you going to come together universe says you have you still have so much potential and so much love to grow for both of you okay so what now the moon the moon means you can feel each other okay the moon means there's like all these changes that you went through it might be thinking like yeah what there's so much a secrets like you need to know the answers you need to spirit guy says you don't have to know the answers to everything the moon also means trust your intuition you what you what you're asking your heart already knows if your heart is trying to tell you that is the special person something is something is um something is still there okay or he's the one or she's the one you're still very much connected okay so that's how i could understand right now like you know um you're going through you're both going through some changes right now you and then your partner as well how are you going to put the puzzles together but i but universe says you are each other's key and lock okay no one else is going to to um open the lock their lock you you carry the key even if there's others going to duplicate the key but there's no one else who's going to be like you so every day if there's any karmic okay or any bad juju is trying to imitate you it's a message from universe that they're not going to it's just a cover but they're not going to imitate you there's only one you so maybe there's also a message from your partner that you know in this journey there's only one you or you are my one and only so something like that i don't know so try, but i'm picking that up you know i'm a supernatural channeler and sometimes i may not understand queen of ghosts is queen of cups there's only you in my heart and i'm so sorry in this journey you might think like you might be waiting for me forever you might think like you're the only one trying in our connection you might think like where i'm at because i'm you know i was stuck and feeling lost for a while but you are there you never lose the faith or sometimes you'll be feeling sensitive and and feeling hopeless and i don't want to see you in pain like that so anyway universe says there's a feminine here she's intuitive emotional sensitive and waiting for her lover future spouse soulmate one and only significant other to come back or come in her life okay so right now um i think um maybe there's a feminine here she gravitate to the moon the full moon she talked to the moon like universe she talked to the moon and the stars so please bring my true love in my life please help us clear away all these obstacles so i kind of like pile three you know is universe listening to your prayer yes okay so talk to god angels universe they're listening just because you went through a lot of trauma and pain so you're a healer okay if there's a divine feminine here pile three you're a healer okay i you're capable of healing yourself and others okay knight of bats you could be a healer but you know the downside of being an empath like worker angel you can feel deeply you can feel emotions you can uh, be angry when you're angry you love when you love 
but stay away from drama okay or this could be a message from someone i am here i'm coming your way give me five minutes <laughs> oh my gosh i'm running towards you i'm not running away from you anymore i'm going to be your knight in shining armor and sweep you off your feet and just let's just get away from all this mess so it feels like that's how i could understand right now um someone coming your way who's like fed up and sick of this competition pressures in the society and all the drama they realize that their happiness is not there so now um they they are in a rush now okay to come your way so and you are here, pile three. You are waiting, trusting your intuition, asking universe and angels. And sometimes you might be thinking like, are you losing it? Are you losing it? What is this? But Spirit Guide says, trust your intuition. There's much more things, okay? Like it's not, nothing. That's why they call it supernatural because it's something that cannot be explained by the laws of nature sometimes you just have to give up of logical reasons rational reasons because we're out of that okay we're over that we believe that anything is possible okay we believe that something something is much more at work here and it's a universal force it's a cosmic force so what now two of m's two of m's is two of ones so right now universe says you will find each other, okay? So, anyway, this is a message from someone, okay? Your partner. I will find you whatever it takes, my love, to merge our destiny. Or you, this is your prayer, pile three. Find me, my love. I'm here waiting for you. But he's already trying to say he is here, okay? Because two of him is destiny, is partnership, is coming together. It could be a two-year window or maybe you're already on that two-year window, so what now, King of Bats? Because they're going to make things right with you. King of Bats is King of Swords. It's a divine masculine energy stepping into their truth because they know their truth. They don't want any more baggage and drama. They're, they just want to be happy now, okay? Although for a time, this person also like was guarded, okay? On their emotions or they are um, like really... They also like wearing the journey so they can be happy. But now they realize that you are their one and only, their true love, and you are their happiness. So I think this is what I could understand. It's a divine masculine trying to say, I will fight for you. I will come in your life i want to be with you very very soon that's it okay that's the message i cannot wait to be with you very 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 soon because you are you yeah because at one point in their life they have trouble seeing who's true and who loves them but at the end of the day or in this very difficult journey they know that your love is true so your message whatever you tell them is the honest truth anyway so and then they realize that in order to be happy in order to be fulfilled into this journey they cannot fool themselves anymore so that's how i could see you have my heart okay so because you are you and you have my heart there you go so try enough said i don't want to love anyone else if it's not you i do not want to go on in this life without you so something like that you are a part of me maybe before i was just hopeless or just really like do not know what is best for me but now that i know intuitively or in my heart because i'm going to to ask god or angels where you're going to be or if we if you already know each other so this is a person that's going to make things right with you and trying to tell you they don't want to let you go so anyway um so tribe you know i know this love story always have drama but for now this I may not understand what I'm channeling for you right now until I am going to watch the replay. But so far, this is it. It is you. I knew from. I knew it from the start. Well, 
whoever your partner is, pile three, they're smart, okay? They're a good person, they're a good man, a good woman, okay? Or simply be, I'm picking up like a masculine energy, it's a very good man, okay? Even though there's, there's some mistakes, but they're a good person. And they also knew the truth that something special about you that it is you from the very very start they could have been going round and round and round and round and then just to realize that whatever they're searching is already there in their life okay but i feel like you know i guess they have to venture into the unknown so and and go see the greener pastures on the other side just so they can see okay they can compare but they're already trying to tell you no one compares to you that's the reason why because you are you others going to be thinking like they can duplicate you but no one else can duplicate you because you are you you're the only one you are half of my soul and no one else is going to duplicate that sorry so child that's all i can understand but that's heavy okay friendships okay you are my best friends you're the one who gets me i can talk to you others going to be just saying like yeah they get me but they don't really get me so i'm asking universe and our guides now and and god up above to help us be together so what now yeah to come together to bring us that magical bridge so please wait for me my love please wait for me my love i am coming that's your message okay i'm coming to make your wish come true and make my wishes come true as well because my wish is you my wish is for us to be together my wish is for me to love you and my wish is for you to love me and we're going to be happy 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 together well anyway that's how i can understand or this is also a message that your partner whatever the distance whatever the gap whatever the misunderstanding they never stop dreaming about you they never stop thinking about you until then you just need to uh, really meet each other halfway come together okay the communication the passage right now and you needing support and help as well from community from trustworthy people from guardians and angels to to lead you where you need to be so you can be on the right path both of you okay so you can have your union okay so anyway because you are each other's prayer you are each other's wish and you are each other's dream and that's why you are in the path right now but somewhere along the road there's like a lot of twists and turns but you are in this journey that's why we are checking on your update you're currently trying to maneuver all these twists and turns okay so you're not still going to deviate on the path and you're going to go on um and carry on in your journey okay until until you're going to have your union okay so this is what i could understand who my goodness my soul tribe flowers for all of you my soul tribe see it's so beautiful look there's loaded in here so never say that kitty cat did not try their spine tree is really like really really festive now and everybody be thinking like what am i carrying because i'm always carrying leaves <coughs> or i'm carrying on flowers but you know what's so trying no one is going to say no to kitty cat because whatever i'm I do what I do, my soul child. But I am happy that I that I pick these fresh flowers, fresh pine cone, fresh pine tree with fresh water, okay, for every one of you. I love you all, my soul child. And if you want to support our channel, so you going to give kitty cat inspiration, then you can donate. 
on my PayPal link or my Cash App, or you can uh, support me by requesting your update three questions five questions and email me spiritual explorer 1111 at gmail.com and lately i've also written messages and holistic self-love affirmations on my website so you can check my website as well for some like you know something like something messages and posts and updates there so www.spiritualexplorer1111.com okay so so try happy happy thursday and i know the weekend is going to come up it's a beautiful cold breezy day today and definitely we are in the autumn vibe i could see the autumn leaves the changing colors of the leaves in up in the trees it's so beautiful my soul tribe and then new york is filled with all this autumn flowers so i pick it all in the garden in the trees in the ground in the earth and that's what kitty cat is good so not just going to be keep meowing here okay I love you all so try talk to you soon i will see you soon i just took a moment to really like do this reading and hope you resonate okay and if not then we'll try again we keep learning again and you cannot blame kitty cat for not trying okay so try so god bless every one of you pray for me and i also pray for you so tribe so take care of you out there okay and <laughs> magic what is that oh my goodness are you cold she's possibly just licking all this furry blanket okay come on magic let's go up oh, come on come on come on come on magic let's go come on ah oh, she doesn't want to get out of the blanket okay so so tribe i'm going now take care of you bye for now